is incredible that you're saying today we're 10 to 15 degrees cooler than the weekend and we're still in the 90s in so many places. Oh, absolutely. We're still near record highs with that big drop in temperatures. You know, usually when you say 10 to 15 degrees cooler, it feels a whole lot cooler. And that is just not the case today. It is still exceptionally hot. Here's another live shoot for, uh, look from Lion's Peak looking towards the east, towards the Valley Fire. The smoke here has been getting substantially worse just within the last hour. So that is definitely not good news for the firefight going on out there. It is hot. It's already in the 90s in Ramona and in Alpine. And yes, that is significantly cooler than where it was yesterday. Some areas over 20 degrees colder than 24 hours ago. The winds have come down quite a bit, but they're already starting to pick up just a little bit. Wind gusts near 11 miles per hour near Hamul, where that fire is burning. As far as those winds go tonight, they're not going to pick back up. But tomorrow night into Wednesday morning, this is 4 a.m. on our 10 News Futurecast. In particular, the foothill and the mountain areas are going to see that brighter colors indicating the stronger winds. This is going to be a huge concern to the firefight for the Valley Fire. We'll see winds in that 30 to potentially 50 mile per hour range. Add on the 10 to 15 percent humidity levels and any fire that is already burning like the Valley Fire or any new fire sparks will be able to spread quickly. That fire weather watch likely getting upgraded to a warning, a red flag warning at some point today. Right now it will be in effect tomorrow afternoon through Wednesday evening. Wednesday morning will be the worst of it. And I think we're gonna be talking about some big changes to the Valley Fire going in the wrong direction. Along the coast, we'll drop down to the 70s tomorrow after being in the triple digits yesterday. But those offshore winds return Wednesday, ushering in another warm up. We'll be back in the 80s, even near 90 for the coastal areas. Inland neighborhoods, Quite a bit cooler tomorrow down into the 80s and then right back into the 90s on Wednesday and we'll stay in the 90s through the weekend. Mountain areas will actually see much cooler air coming in. So by midweek, we'll be actually dropping to the 70s, but especially tomorrow night into early Wednesday morning, fire danger is going to be very high with strong gusty winds. The desert area is a scorcher today near 120, but down to the 90s by Wednesday.